We hope you and everyone you know is starting every day with the Good Morning Minute of Inspiration podcast as we discuss today's quote and spread some insight on developing a positive attitude and the mental toughness to succeed in life, business, and athletics. Well, folks, we've gone over 53,000 downloads of this podcast, 53,000 downloads and growing. We're in 30 countries. We're being heard around the world, 30 different countries, 29 of the United States here, the states in, in, in the United States, I guess. So we're hoping to get to all of our states shortly. And we just continue to help and we just continue to praise you for spreading our information all over social media, for paying it forward, for the financial donations, for the people sponsoring the podcast. All of that stuff is helping Get us close to our cause, which is bring a little inspiration to the world each and every morning. Hey, um, mental toughness. We define it as the ability to move forward under pressure. We believe it's the most important thing that you need to develop in your life. It's the only way you're going to get past the struggles, the setbacks, the tragedies that happen in this world. And they happen each and every day. And they happen to everybody. Nobody gets past them. You're not different because something has happened to you. It happens to all of us. We all have problems. Problems arise each and every day. It's how we handle them problems. How we deal with them problems and solve them problems that determines where we go in this world. But mental toughness. It's the ability to move forward under pressure. It's something that we believe strongly that you need to develop. We've created a free booklet. It's a 10-page booklet on the five Ps to success. Passion, perception, perspective, progressing, and perseverance. We believe you need all five of those areas. We tell you how to develop those areas and how to use them areas to create this mental toughness, this ability to move forward under pressure. It's a free booklet we give you free of charge. All you have to do is go to our website, inspiringthem.com, inspiringthem.com, the pop-up window give us your information we'll send it out to you free of charge or in the show notes below you can link to that so it's pretty simple to get that free booklet today hey this is coach p jim pusateri and you're listening to this good morning minute of inspiration podcast where each day we bring you a short inspirational message to kick off your morning and to put you into positive attitude needed to succeed and to win the day Yes, good morning out there, Move Forward Nation of listeners, and I thank you for downloading episode number 351. Today's quote of the day, whatever, whenever you feel like giving up, remember why you set this goal in the first place. Whenever you feel like giving up, remember why you set this goal in the first place. Folks, it happens. You know, life is... uh, is, is a journey and sometimes along that journey you get tired and you feel like giving up you feel like you've tried this long enough you feel like you failed so many times you can't go another time well it's when you feel that way that you need to have this mental toughness this ability to move forward under pressure and part of that is is to be able for you to understand why did you set the goal in the first place that you're working on because remember folks goals are things that you want in life. So why would you give up something that you determined you wanted in life? Why quit? Continue to move forward. The only way you're going to reach that goal is to not quit to move forward. So whenever you feel like giving up, remember why you set the goal in the first place. Are you setting goals or are you just a dreamer? Dreamers dream. They float through life with all these great ideas, but never commit them to paper. They never put them in a journal. They never reflect on them. They never have a formal plan of action on how to achieve them. So 10 years from now, they'll have the same dreams that they have today. But goal setters achieve their dreams because they commit them to a formal plan. They put a date on them when they want to accomplish them. They don't always accomplish them on the date that they put down. Because tough things happen in life. Things knock you off course. Things get in the way. But if you have a goal and you've written it down, you'll get right back on it where you let off instead of having to start over all the time. And there's going to be a time when you feel like giving up. But remember, why did you set the goal? Why was this goal important to you? 
You have to know your whys. Why was the goal important to you? That's what you have to know. Whenever you feel like giving up, remember why you set the goal in the first place. Folks, if you're a goal setter, you're going to achieve. The only way you won't achieve is if you quit. Now, we talked about some of the things you need to do to develop this mental toughness. And we always said the biggest thing is to change the way you see things. Yesterday, we talked a little bit about how to use journals. Today, we're going to talk a little bit about reflection. Tomorrow we're going to talk about what's your why, but that kind of relates into today's thing. Remember why you set the goal. What is your why? Folks, reflection. Do you reflect? If you have a formal game plan and you've broken it down into action steps and you broke the action steps into smaller tasks and you're scheduling your tasks each and every day, you need to reflect at the end of the day. How many tasks did I get done? What went good with the task? What went wrong with the task? What do I need to improve? to make the task successful. That's reflection. You need to reflect on your life. You need to understand what's going good, what's going bad. That's part of having this game plan. Do you know if you're winning or losing? Are you close or are you far away? Are your thoughts getting you closer to your goals or are they moving you farther away? That's all reflection. Reflect on the whys in life. Reflect on the things that are important to you in life. Reflect on what your passion is in life. Reflect on how you can make your career in line with your passion so you never have to work a day in your life. Whenever you feel like giving up, remember why you set the goal in the first place. I'm telling you to learn to reflect. Learn to have some quiet time in your day. Open your mind. Reflect. Ideas will pop into your head. Write them down into your journal and end up making them a goal if they're important to you. If you know why the why, then make it a goal. Whenever you feel like giving up, remember why you set the goal in the first place. If you're an iTunes subscriber and asking you to go over and leave us a ranking, a one star to a five star, we appreciate it as it helps get this podcast out to more and more people. If you're a business owner, As always, we're asking you to sponsor this podcast. If you're a listener and you can afford to donate, we're asking you to donate to this podcast. You can go to inspiringthem.com, inspiringthem.com. Either hit the donate button or you hit the business owners button down there to advertise. Sponsor our podcast. We appreciate all the donations. We appreciate all the sponsorships. And as always, if you can't afford any of that stuff, folks, and hey, you know, we get it. You know, life is tough. We get it. And you're a goal setter, and you got dreams, and you're trying to achieve your dreams. If the only way you can pay this forward is by spreading it all over social media to all your contacts and stuff, it's good enough for us. We appreciate it. Again, our cause is to bring a little inspiration to the world each morning. Your donations will allow us to keep this free of charge, to keep this information moving forward. Hey, if you have a question for me, maybe you'd like to have something discussed on the show, Maybe you got a favorite quote you'd like me to feature on the podcast. You can email me at coachjrp at gmail.com. That's coachjrp at gmail.com. Or you can uh, hit the uh, button down in our show notes and you can leave a voicemail or a, a message. And who knows? You know, make a comment about our show. We may use it on our show. You know, we may use that message on our show. We like hearing from our listeners. You know, this Move Forward Nation of Listeners is a very positive group of people who are moving forward in life, developing this mental toughness, developing this ability to move forward under pressure. So we love hearing from you. Again, email me, coachjrp at gmail.com. Leave us a voice message. There's a link in the show notes there. You can go ahead and do that. Hey, this is Coach P. Jim Pusateri. And my passion is to educate and inspire people to move forward towards success. How can I help you? Develop the mental toughness to succeed. How can I help you understand whenever you feel like giving up, remember why you set the goal in the first place. Folks, don't give up on your goals. That means you're a quitter. Why quit? Hey, they may not happen in time. They may take 20 years to reach it. But you reached it. You accomplished it. You achieved it. A lot of people quit along the way. Because they forget about their why. Why 
they established a goal in the first place. There's a reason you wanted that in your life. There's a reason you committed it to paper. There's a reason you put a date on it. There's a reason why you broke it into action steps. There's a reason why you've been scheduling the task. Why quit now? Keep moving forward. You'll reach that goal. You'll reach that success. Dreamers dream. They're the ones that are going to quit. But us goal setters, we achieve because we continue on. We forge forward. We have the mental toughness. We have the ability to move forward under pressure. I know you do. Keep moving forward. Don't give up on them goals. Hey, this is Coach P telling you have yourself a great day today. Move forward and accomplish everything that you want in this life. Goal setters achieve. Coach P out. Do you need to improve your writing skills? Get the smartest and easiest writing tool. Head on over to acree.com. That's E-C-R-E-E dot com. Poor writing skills are closing doors on students' athletic and academic futures. Acree's artificial intelligence gives you teacher-quality feedback on your writing while you work. Instead of waiting days or weeks for a teacher or tutor to tell you what you're doing well and what needs more work, you get instant help from Acrees, right in the margin. 95% of students improve their writing scores using instant, unlimited help from Acree. With Acree, you'll be more confident that you're communicating well and expressing your ideas before you even show your writing to a writing expert. Go create an account with Acree right now. E-C-R-E-E dot com, your on-demand writing tutor. That's E-C-R-E-E dot com, Acree.